I guess we all really have been singing in Africa by Toto wrong this whole time, huh? I guess we have. So Moonfall is a movie about the moon mysteriously being knocked out of orbit and now it is on a collision course with the Earth. I usually start out with what I like in movies, but there really isn't much to like here with Moonfall. But I thought John Bradley as Casey was pretty decent in this film. I also thought Patrick Wilson and Halle Berry were alright in this film. They do their best with what they can with the script, but um, like I said, not too much to like here with Moonfall. My favorite character in this film, hands down, has to be Michael Pena's Tom Lopez. Which really kind of sucks because he's only in this film for about 10 to 15 minutes. Another positive of Moonfall is that at times the CGI and the special effects can look pretty good. Wow, looking back on this film, it's even worse than what I thought. Wow. Now for what I don't like. And get ready because there's a lot I did not like in this film. I really wish I could say this whole movie, but um, that wouldn't be much of a review now, would it? I thought the script for this film was absolutely horrible. It's cheesy. It's cringy and it's just flat out awful. Some of the special effects and CGI in this film look terrible and every time there's a scene with the green screen in the background, it looks even worse. The more I think about this film, the worse it really gets. There are some scenes in this film that are so bad. I was laughing, the guy next to me was laughing. Shout out my teammate Corey, he was laughing too. I mean, this film is just awful. Also, a lot of people in the theater were on their phones about halfway through the movie and it's just horrible. Like, it's really hard to describe how bad this movie is. There's also a car chase scene in this film that looks absolutely horrible. It makes no sense at all. And to be honest, it looks like it's straight out of a Kia Christmas commercial. Oh, this review's hard because I can't stop myself from laughing. Wow. There's also another scene in this film where this guy gets absolutely crushed by a tree. Like when I say crushed, he gets absolutely destroyed. And he's just laying on the ground with the tree right on his chest. And like, he'd probably be dead. At least his diaphragm would be crushed. And this lady comes over to help him and he goes, go, save yourself. And it was just such bad acting, so cheesy. It was just awful. And to be honest, a lot of people in the theater started laughing. There's also a few subplots in this film that you really could care less for. But I guess a good thing about these subplots is that's where Michael Pena's character, Thomas Lopez, really shines. I also thought the enemy in this film was just stupid. It looks like a ripoff version of Transformium from Transformers Age of Extinction. There's also so many plot holes in this film. I do not even know where to begin. The whole car ride back from the theater with my teammate Corey, we just sat there and talked about all these plot holes and it really just made the movie that much worse. The ending makes it look like the door is possibly open for a sequel and I really hope that's not the case as this film is just a complete waste of two hours. Please do yourself a favor this weekend and do not see this film. It is a complete waste of time, it's a complete waste of gas, and it's a complete waste of money. But if you are going to the movies this weekend, I highly recommend you see Jackass or Scream basically any other movie in the theaters right now except Moonfall. Please do not do that to yourself. With all that being said, Moonfall gets 1.7 stubs out of 10. This movie is a pure and utter joke. I really wouldn't be surprised if this film ends up in my top 10, maybe even top 5 for worst movies of 2022. As always, if you like what you saw here and you want to see more, click up here to see more. Also, do not forget to subscribe and to click the bell to turn on post notifications so you never miss a future video. Also, if you have been enjoying the content on the channel recently, please make sure to share it around as it really helps the channel out. Well, that's all I got for today, guys. Peace. Please do not let there be a sequel to this film, please.